isn't. But how? Oh, I had a second thing. I forgot about that. <laughs> well, then I'll mute it now. And put on the other one that's actually set up. That one makes more sense. You probably couldn't tell the difference. Hello, Joke Hog Girl. It's weird, the Streamlabs thing doesn't want to update that you're here. It's it's still telling me no one's here yet, so I, I stayed quiet. Continued to set things up. Man, I don't know. Everything's broken. You move from the right side to the middle. Oh, fair enough. That makes sense. My microphone automatically only does the right channel for some reason. And I had to manually fix it. You were just snailing around? That's that's fair. We had a bunch more people before, and then my computer decided, ah, screw you. Go do something else. But, uh, oh well. It's the po The things that I'm testing or trying to fix today, there are two main issues. One is if I watch a YouTube video, it gets horribly desynced for some reason. And the other is my Elgato doesn't work suddenly. Um, but I'm pretty sure it's not the Elgato that's the issue, because I bought it like a month ago. So I've done a full-on hard reset on my entire PC. Um, let me bring down the music a tad, it's a bit in my ears too much. There we go. I, um, I decided to do like a hard reset on my PC, which meant it deleted um, all of my like applications and drivers and everything I'd need to re-download. So I've been doing that all day today, and then I thought I'd covered everything. Thank you, YouTube, for a little advert. Can you get out my face? Thank you. I don't need to hear about the shape of whatever. Um, and then I'd set up everything else, you know, re-downloaded Streamlabs, I re-downloaded Dolphin, I'd done this and that, Google Chrome, all your usual, and then just as I started streaming, I realized I didn't actually have my microphone one done. So then I did that, and then it was like, you better restart. So then I did just before I started streaming, so it was like moments before, and then it was like, rest restart again for some reason. I have no idea why. It is done. It fixed itself. What? There was something else I changed. Oh, whatever. Had new problems trying to set up the microphone, but we're all good now. I need to check that my voice sounds fine, but it sounds like I sound fine. Although you're saying I'm lagging, well then let me check that out. I might have to restart again. My voice sounds fine, but it sounds like I sound fine. Although you're saying I'm lagging, well then let me check that out. I might have to restart again. That sounds normal, I think. Um. Though it sounded like it lagged at the very beginning. Maybe it's the music in the background? Like, is it that audio? You don't lag to me. Well, there you go. Fair enough. Let me check again. In the background? Like, is it that audio? You don't lag to me. Well, there you go. Sounds pretty smooth to me. I'm afraid, Aquatic Lion Dude, it's all you. But, hello, Aquatic Lion Dude, and hello, Fang. You think it's working? Good stuff. You might just have to refresh. Um, now I didn't get to say hi to everyone who was here a moment ago because I couldn't speak But I can see who has sent those bits so far today. So thank you aquatic lion dude for four bits Meep with ten let the scoobs begins That didn't make sense as much as I thought it would Two more rounds of two bits from aquatic lion dude and another four bits from Meep with more scoobs Thank you very much everybody Has Daz died yet? Yes, I died a handful of times two or three times I think in the whole stream yesterday Two? Three? Three. Three times I think we died. Yes. Three times without you. So do be sure to add that to our counter. Now hopefully the other half of things work themselves out. Because I haven't actually checked like the live, the live screen. Is my webcam going to be broken? Let's find out. No, I think I look fine. Um, everything needs to pop into existence. Good stuff. But, oh, I need to set up my window capture. Let's get rid of this music. Thank you. Get up Dolphin, which I can now do with a single double click now that I've worked out how to make my videos or my games actually show up on Dolphin, which is nice. Oh, and it's already ready there. Um, Last time I had the microphone like this. I might try it a little bit more, but it's harder to look this way for some reason when the microphone's here. Let me look the other way and give it a, give it a test. If anything sounds wrong, let me know. Like, is the game somehow jittery? I'll be annoyed because it's the Elgato that's got jittery audio. How did I do this with the mouse before? I'll put it around there. And if it's too loud, also let me know. Or too quiet. You know, it's, it should be the same as last time. But something might have changed. Um, right. 
That's way too in the face. I don't know what to do with the mouse. No, no, I just... <laughs> I'll look that... I can see the screen if I have it this side. Let me just keep it like that. You're gonna have to watch the re-watch the stream now. You gotta be as accurate as you can. Okay. You're wondering if I died in real life. No. Thankfully, I'm lingering on. My YouTube career almost died. I'd even created like a death date plotted for it. And then I started doing good again. So, perhaps not. Let me bump you up a bit. There we go. More on my face. Hope you don't mind. I'll try not to hide behind my mic so much. Got to expose myself. How much space do I have? I have low. Well, I kind of get lost here. But who leans over here? That just doesn't. That doesn't make sense. Hmm. 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 That looks better. And I imagine I'm audible. Yes, I'm plenty loud. So we'll go with that. Then, uh, better have the mic, the right controller. Now, I played this for two hours yesterday. Yesterday, yes. And I got kind of doled down by it. Uh, for a start, also, actually. Does my file still exist? Whew, it does. Good. Six percent done already. Barry, I've only played for an hour. Oh. Oops. Um, but I got really dumbed down with it. Like, I got started thinking about, like, just the level design and thinking of it in really simplistic terms. I hope there's no echo, by the way. I shouldn't have multiple audio levels going on, right? No, I think we're fine. Um, oh, that's different. Chozo Ruins. Actually, I think we did see that at one point. But for whatever reason, like, when I went to bed, I was like, I wanted to play more. Like, I, I thought I was sick of it. And then I was like, no, I'm in the mood to play some of this. We might still have to deal with some lagginess in places just because the game is a bit choppy on this emulator. Not usually that choppy. Hopefully it will like, yeah, energy spike, more like a lag spike. Um, it's especially laggy on this map. Okay, so I guess that's where I need to go, to the furnace. Great, where's the way into it? But I, I just want to explore. I feel like exploring. You can't shoot me down for that now, can you? You can when the game half freezes, but otherwise, like, I could get behind this. I want to I wanna do some more exploring. And I, I've seen some of the, a bit of a preview of the future things that appear in this game from the title screen of this game. And I want to play the second and third eventually. So I'm just going to sort of face my fears and get on with it. Now, why don't we, I mean, like, how do I, how do I even get close to that way? Go through that. We'll do that. Which was a pathway? Could we even go that way? We're going to. We're going to explore. That's what Metroid's all about. It's about exploring these kind of closed off little portal-like areas. And so you know what? I'm going to do it. I'm in a lot more of a Metroid-y mood for some reason. I don't know why. I just played it and I got an addiction. What can I, what can I, what can I say? Also, hello Bagman crew. Thank you for joining us. I see that sleeping has helped me remember the controls, which is always nice. Oh, I might still end up getting a bit annoyed at the controls or like dying, but that's fine. Um, I still gotta at some point try and scan those guys, but haven't succeeded yet. So yes, we now have Morph Ball and Morph Bombs, so we can get on with this. This is my least favourite room, but you know what, I will gladly get into it. I don't know, I don't know why, like, I'm not feeling a nostalgic for it or anything. But I'm feeling just in the mood to like explore this. It's nice. It's it's genuinely nice. Like it's nice to feel this kind of passion for the game as much as I didn't like it a moment ago. Oh man, you can hit me from here, dude. Get out of my way. All right, it's just not. I, I could not have done that much worse. So what you can do is become ball, leave bomb. And then progress right through again, and perfectly aim myself to get hit by lasers. Okay, that better not be more of a beehive. Blast shield. Lovely. Okay. Maybe I should try like moving more slowly. Hello, Broken Dylan. Thank you for the host. Everybody's here. That's kind of the usual. It is a Saturday. What have people been up to? What do people usually do on a Saturday? Like, I find, oddly enough, that, like, in real life, a lot of people I know are, like, being out social, doing things, and I'm always the one that doesn't show up because I'm doing this. Or I'll, like, I'll rock up 
at like half past ten after running halfway across where I live. What? To get to it. What am I to do here? What's going on in the map? There's something up top. Ah. Is that anti-gravity, like, a, is that anti-gravity ball or something? Can I jump up here? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, do I just jump on the pipes? Yes. This look, this feels like anti-gravity ball. Able to access magnetic rail system. Spider ball augmentation required. Oh. Unable to access. I see. You've been food shopping, brought my boyfriend to the hairdresser, made an advent can Adam kind of decoration and gone to work. That sounds like a very eventful Saturday. That is in my soul. Okay, so what? Do I have to come back here later? Um, is there more I can do with these? I don't want to waste my energy stuff on it. Okay. I think I have to come back later for this then. That's a shame. But oh well. I'm in the mood to like explore. That's what it's about. It's not about like getting through the level quickly. Okay, very weird. It's just, do, unless it's gonna say like you're trapped now. Nope, it's not. It's happy for me to do what I do. Thank you. Can I see where I'm going this time? Haha! -ha. I didn't land in the acid this time. Not oil. Oh. Fang, you've been playing a game for, future, for a future review on your channel. Ah, it's not gone well. Oh. It's one of those reviews, is it? I've actually been meaning to do a, a video game review myself at some point. It's going to be in a completely different style and doing some new things. Ugh. I'll have it set. I've got two, actually, I think I want to do before the beginning of 2019. That'll be interesting. Ugh. Am I on top of a mushroom? I am not. Lovely. I could get behind this. If I if I had played this game, or like if I knew this game... Like, like it was a childhood game. I could definitely see myself like, let's playing this and talking about all the details. All right, that's what fouls the water, seek the sun. I did not time that right, as per usual. Um, in that case, if we're not going to that spot anymore, we'll go there. That is a point of interest apparently, which is up in the vine area and to the right from here. Okay, I think, I might have read that map wrong. One level, one hour on it, still haven't beaten it. Youch. That does not sound like the most fun. Unless it's like the last level. But probably not. Cool. You cannot believe you've done more than two productive things on a weekend. Congratulations. I, myself, am a bit of a workaholic that I, I have to do something productive all the time. It helps that I, uh, I do YouTube. So it means I can do everything all the time. Like, I don't have a day off in the week. You know, which I mean, I guess to some people's kind of unfathomable, but that's the life I've always led. Like I've been doing this since I was 15, you know, and I'm 22 now. So um, I'm just used to always working. Sundays are like one of my busiest because I've got to prepare. Oh, because I've got to oh, prepare for bees. I need to prepare for a Monday upload. Was that what I was going to say? I guess so. Yeah. It's weird, I've discovered something new. And that is that, does this, by the way, does this do it? No, it just morphs all, oh, of course. Bomb, that'll do it. Um, I found that the most views I get in, the, in any day of the week is Tuesday. That seems like an odd day to me, but I find all my views always peak the most on a Tuesday. I don't know what people are doing on a, like do most people, do you guys watch my videos on a Tuesday? Why Tuesday? You know, like all, all analytics say it should be the weekend, you know? Friday, Saturday, Sunday, that's the time. That's why I always used to upload then. And then I'm like, okay, that hurts. Oh, hurts small organisms, huh? And I count as a small organism at that point, do I? Great. Look at that education. And I read the scan notes and I remembered. But no, I find it, I find it really weird. So now I have an upload on Mondays. Completely by accident, I just usually upload on Sundays, but Monday works better. Ah, here we are. You're probably going to get a Nintendo 64 for Christmas. Ooh. 
Fair enough. Live like it's 1996 again. Or, or what? Sure, people got them on 1996, I'm sure. I was three months old, Christmas 1996. Oh, that's in the title screen. Can I go up this way? Yeah, I kind of don't want to risk it. You know what, never mind. We'll, we'll go the normal way. Oh. Now, do you guys all know about... Oh, no, it's this again. Do you guys know about Metroid Prime? Like, is this... Do you know this, like, the back of your front? Do you know this, like, the back of your front? You know what I mean? This decorative gate is obstructing passage through the doorway. Four runic symbols adorn its surface. Matching symbols within this may access the room. Gotcha! I'll do some aiming around. Not a disastrous level design, I don't think. Oh, I would have had to come up here to do it all anyway. Actually, maybe not. What does this one say? Okay, just as there's four that need to be activated, and that one is activated now. I'll backtrack a bit, shall I? I don't know why I'm in more of a mo move to mood to do it now. Why is it? Why is this more fun to me this time? I guess I don't know. Just got the mindset for it. I get more of how the gameplay works. I'm because uh, it's a it's a slow game. Maybe I'm in a slower mood. I thought it was quite casual last time, but. Now I'm just like, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll stop and look around. I'll stop and smell the flowers. It's not a speedrun. As much as I would be interested to see speedruns of this game. Okay, well, I'll just jump onto these. Ugh. I know I've only found one symbol. You'd think I'd do a little bit better. Because these are not symbols, are they? No. Thank you. Not that I actually need to go this way. There's probably some there. Do I have to go the ro I went the wrong way then. Noted. <laughs> the aimbot is still a little weird for Samus, but I'm not going to complain considering this is basically a GameCube game. I mean, it is a GameCube game. Did these get remastered for like the Wii or anything? Oh, did they? They might no. They made Metroid Prime for the Wii, right? Did it have motion controls? I know nothing about Metroid. What did they do with this franchise? You know, it's got quite the following, so surely it's doing something right. Um, oh, you are a symbol. Then I probably could have predicted you. That's typical. You have a ton of memories of watching your oldest brother play this. Sadly, you didn't speak English back then, so I know very little of the story. Oh, fair enough. I feel like this would have been one of those games you probably could have picked up what the story was without the English, but, like, maybe the actions tell you more what's going on. You want to destroy everything. But I don't know. I feel like that was probably a secret thing I should have gone to there. Do I dive down to it, though? No, because I've just done a loop, haven't I? No, it's that... Where was I? I was still up a level. Ah, uh, whatever. I'll come back to it in a bit if I have to. Let me keep looking for now. Like, yeah, that would have taken us back there. Where was the... That's, that's what I'm thinking of. And that is that a platform there? Can I step down, please? That was not quite how I meant to, but I guess I'm taking it. This is what I'm talking about. Yeah. It definitely teach me how to use these controls. Cool. That's what, like three out of four, I think? Alright, I guess I'll go this way now. There is nowhere to go this way. Okay, I see it's from there. Cool. Is that four out of four? I... Yes, yes it is. Lovely. All those pirate files and scan stuff, I think most of the lore is in those. Ah, good job I'm scanning stuff. I am curious to know. I am an explorative person. I, ah, I've, oh, you would have loved if I could have lived in a world where I could actively explore. I mean, I guess there's things like, like escape room kind of things where you get those simulated moments, but I'd love to go through it for real, you know? Like, I think I'd quite like, I'd like this, I would quite like the scrounging lifestyle, I think. Like, if there was an apocalypse, like you see in Fallout, and then you could just, like, 
go into like some abandoned town and just grab things. I'd love to do that. Like I've seen videos of people that have like gone into, I mean, it's a bit like morally iffy, but there's been people that have gone to like horrible earthquake places or like abandoned towns and found like, um, you know, like, em like empty shops full of just magazines everywhere and just taken stuff. And I'm like, that seems so fun. You know, not that I plan to like rip off the companies that are selling there or anything. I'm just like, there's things that people aren't using accessible for you. You know, uh, I don't know, I just love it a lot. Um, these guys can't hurt me, right? But they're red. So do they hurt? They do. Okay. Thank you for being very obvious and colorblind friendly, game. But we're getting into serious stuff. Is that not a sign I can read? Apparently it's not. Okay. Hmm. Thank you. I'm curious to see like the the oops, the like the variety of enemies here. But doesn't want to tell me there. Looks like a spy, uh, an ant thing. Odd, the hazard meter doesn't warn about them. You played the verses of this game, so you don't know anything about the story. Ah, didn't know it existed. Now that looks like a boss to me. Especially because, is it the big room? Oh, what do you know? It's the big room. Will you teach me anti-gravity balls? You don't look anything like anti-gravity. You don't flash red when I'm not in the room, but we'll go with it. The trilogy, the prime trilogy had motion controls, but it's quite rare. Okay. Hello. How does everyone, how does nature have all this technological stuff? Is that like the, the theme? It's nature and nurture combined? I guess it makes sense. That's kind of a thing. Like, how do these, how does this foie gras? It sounds like a, you sound like a French cuisine. That's, I'm thinking of foie gras. Foie, foie, foie gras? You know what I mean. Right, what do you got? You've got, you've got like Phantom Ganon-esque moves. Okay. Your head motion doesn't quite... Oh, let's scan you for a bit. Yeah, why did I not think of that? Scan object out of range. There we go. This thing is ugly. A new creature entry. Morphology Flagra. This mutant plant is the source of toxic water in the ruins. Ah. Flagra's growth cycle has been radically accelerated. As a result, it requires near constant exposure to solar energy to remain active. This exposure has made Flagra's outer shell thick and durable. Its lower root system is unprotected and vulnerable, however. Exploit this flaw when possible. Concentrated weapon fire can daze it for short periods. All right. Cool. Look at that. Full on scanning teaches you how to play the game, because I would have gotten stuck. One of Flagra's tentacles fills this narrow drainage channel. Analysis indicates that Flagra's central nervous system is located at the base of this structure. Can I shoot you? It doesn't want me to. Nope. Alright, I will keep I'll keep going along then. If I can. Ooh. Right, there's gotta be more to this area, right? Feels like there is. How are you hitting me already? My energy's going down. How what what is this aimbot you've got, dude? That's better, thank you. So like, how do I get through? Hmm. There, ouch, more to see anywhere. There's these sections, but that's all acid. Oh, okay. I thought I was getting like an extra cutscene because I kind of am. Oh, bombs? Aha, uh -huh, fake you out. That does nothing. But it does bat you away, bat me away. Yeah. Okay, so no, we're just taking lots of damage, that's what's happening now. Can I turn around and leave? Nope, no of course I can't. Uh, what other things do I have? I have missiles, which I've missed with twice. Nothing injures it, what, what else? <laughs> A charge shot. I cannot work out what goes through it. 
Poison Ivy if she was a Dark Souls character. Okay. What other moves do I have? Um, that is you stunned? That is not you stunned. Like, none of these are doing anything. I'm aware that I need to, like, use ball form and get in the center of it. I've kind of worked that bit out. Oh, hello! I forgot about you! Didn't notice you were there! That's why. Right, what is it? Oops. It doesn't want to scan it. Or maybe I looked at it. Okay. Oh man, I am terrible at dodging this thing. You've slightly got like a duplice sound to you. Is this... Nope. What does that do? What does that change? Nothing. But none of the others are active. I needed a bit more time to work that one out, apparently. It's focusing the light on it. I saw that, but it wasn't... It didn't... It didn't do anything. Like, it didn't slow it down, it didn't stun it, and it didn't move any of the roots. That's what I was looking out for. Try and do what I can to get back to where we were. Because I tried to go to the other light modules. Oh, no, I've got to do all this again. Okay, well, I'll try and do it as quick as I can. Um, I wish I was a, there's not a safe option here, is there? Nah, doesn't look like it. Death 4, at least until you see the other scene screen, yeah. Might be Death 3, for all I know. Sorry to plant that uh, lack of clarity. I think it is 4. Four makes sense to me. Ah. Oh. Oh, I guess that's why they did that, in case you do fall. Or pure luck saved it. Actually, this is a completely different section, isn't it? This is where I wanted to be at one point. Because I wanted to look at something else. No? No? Okay. I'll just do my normal. Yeah, this is the- oh, that's why it's just from- it's the entrance from the other door. Oh, dude, what is with me in this? I feel like I've gone the wrong way- there. How did I miss the bridge? Oh, I guess it's back on myself, that's why. Can't hit me out here. Whoops, let's not do that. Blah! Jo you chopped- you chopped garlic for dinner today and have a cold. So every time I blow my nose it smells like garlic. I was like, okay. I was confused then, because I was like, what's the garlic got any relevance? But no, okay, that makes sense. Kind of. There's always one. Weird that it sounded like it was coming from the left, but I guess that might just be, uh... Old stereo sounds? Maybe I got it on mono accidentally? I don't know. This is fun. <laughs> And that's how the room was supposed to be done. Sorry about that, if you don't like thingies. Oh, the hazard meter doesn't warn about the red floor pick- Red floor pickles? That's what you call them? Okay. <laughs> Garlic helps with colds, but smells, you are correct. I love garlic though. Although more than garlic, there's something else I love. Oh, it's mushrooms. I'm just in love with mushrooms. Have I gone the wrong way again? Is it to the furnace? No. Okay, good. Just checking. I really love the atmosphere that Metroid has. Like, it's constantly got that darkness, you know? Oh, dude. 
I was out of your way. Where's the other one? There you are. Oh, hello. And third. Thank you. Right. I still don't understand what the blip 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 sound effect is, but... Have I done this again? Oh, I guess it's, it's still loading. Can someone explain to me what it is? Like, uh, there's that one that activates, and there's that one. Maybe there are just multiple I've got to go to. Hello, Chompley. You absolutely love mushrooms. Your boyfriend despises them. Mm. That's new. I remember the line. Okay, so we want to unactivate those. Can we do that with like a... Oh, the, the lighting turns it on? Like, how is it up? Um, at the very least, can we not mess this up again? Oh, I can do one maybe just on its face? No, okay, I see. It was just how it does it. Yeah, okay. Lower root is unprotected. Kind of. Concentrated fire can daze it. Okay. It kind of makes sense. Not entirely, but it's there a little bit. Look at this one. Game. There you are. Oh. Standard morph ball slot. Right in the middle, of course. This slot is active. How can you not notice the giant root in the center? Inserting the morph ball and detonating a bomb will usually cause these slots to send electrical pulses that can activate different types of devices. Well, that's nice. Can I stop die? So, there's no roots here anymore. Which is nice. You have impeccable aim when I'm already moving. Ah! Oh, nope. That just moves that again. Okay. You're not dazed when I do that, which is always convenient. <sighs> nice and timed. So, like, you do not have a thing on you. Nor does that one. Hmm. That one doesn't either. There's only one that does. Thank you, Momentum. Don't want you to lean straight in it. No, that doesn't do it. Oh man, you're really good at this. Well, how can you, how you keep hitting me every time? Alright, maybe it is just brute forcing it, because it did say like... Just deflecting. I guess this counts as your outer shell that hurt. That's good. Okay, you hit the light once, now hit it more times in succession, aka rapid fire the button. Okay. I feel like that's only putting it more into it's uh, the same slot. Like it feels like it's going through the same animation. Oh. You have to keep hitting it. Ah, oh, that's a little odd, I must admit. But thank you. I wouldn't have probably sort that out. Bam! Classic. Wow, that one but one. I like that. That's literally just him shrinking the model. Okay, here we go. Of course, there's more. Is there four phases? So what? I guess we're taking the lights off. Oh, hello! There's the roots I was wondering about. Ah, oh, okay, and you've got actual slicey diceys now. I see, okay, you're like knocking it out of place. Oh! He's fighting against it. Youch, youch, youch. Can we not? Can we not? 
That seems hard to fight against. He seems too fast at what he does. Alright. <laughs> I find the sound effect of it a bit funny though. It's just like, clong! Oh man. I've already, I'm already low. Like, how are you supposed to do all this in time? Especially when you... I'm pretty sure... You feel like you did a full 180 there. How do you get through that as well? I just do it from a distance is the idea? How? What? This doesn't make sense. You are way too fast for anyone's own good. Am I seriously missing something else? That doesn't make sense. Yeah, I'll do it from a distance. Aim, but not lock on. <laughs> Come on game, I'm enjoying it so far. Why are the save states so sparing? Whose idea was that? Now I am becoming the speedrunner. Oops, wrong button. You stun it, oh, uh, stun it and death five. I it wouldn't stun though. Like, I could stun it by doing both lights, but it didn't give me the time slot to do that, you know? Dude, there you go. Where is that other platform? How am I constantly missing? Oh, I guess it's beyond the door here. Maybe. Yeah. <sighs> Samus. Samus! Never did get any better at that, did I? Um... I might go back and save. You know what? I'm gonna do all the I'm gonna do all the symbols first. That's what I'm gonna do. Alright, bees, come for me. Ah, oh, I thought that would time nicely, that would have been nice. Too convenient if it did that. How is there still more? Ugh. Yeah, definitely gonna need a heal after this one. Excuse me, I didn't do one at the ball. Or the earlier ball. My apologies. I think it's before this. Yeah, there you are. Concentrated fire, it gets stunned. Are you sure? Like. Hmm. Some of, some of these some of these moments in this game. <laughs> I don't even know if this is the right one. It's probably not. I have less and less faith in this way. Yeah, no, nope, wrong wrong door. One of two doors, it was wrong. I'd be curious to see this zoomed out. There is a channel that does that. She says does do that. Not that it would ever uh, load it all at once, but it'd be cool if it could.
Right, I'm going this way just to heal. I don't know if that's actually how I'm supposed to do this in bull form, but I always do in case the steam hurts. I don't know. The delay on shooting, that's a bit of a mishap, but, you know, whatever. So, what we can learn is play, pay close attention to the bios as they give crucial information as on how the boss fight works. Yes. Is that supposed to be a hint? It says it in the... It says it in the bio. Yeah, concentrated fire, but that's on the the roots, and even then, didn't seem to do it. I'll keep trying, but I did it at one point, and it just deflected them all. I, I, I didn't believe my own experience, but you're right, it is in the bios. I probably just did it wrong somewhere, so I will retry. This time a little bit faster, because we've already put in a save slot after doing this room. And we'll get on going with our day now, shall we? Come on, bees. We have to respawn once we've saved, because that is the law. How did I miss that symbol? I guess it wasn't glowing before, but still. Of course, there's one left. It's a shame that it doesn't make that sound this time around. Does it in later games or something? Like, where did that sound effect come from in Melee? And presumably the first game, but I don't know. Came from the original. Ah. Let's get this. I can. Oh, that's nice. How does it find the ball slot over everything else? Like, giant beast shooting right at you. You don't recognize it. You're right, Concentrated Fire is, does work on this guy. It dazes it. I guess I have, to, so I have to daze it between lighting it all up. Okay. Hmm. The sides, man. You're going to make it real difficult to do things with. plant grows a scythe anyway. Right, let's find out a way to stun the guy. That's our next priority, because we are lighting it up. Okay, you are correct. It takes a heck of a lot, but it does stun it. Probably was not enough though, because I didn't stun it at the right time, right? You're gonna clang it? No, you're not. Oh, lucky me. And you just clanged it. How dare you. Thank you. <laughs> Alright, that takes a lot of spamming, but you know what? It's a lot more fun now that I know that it works. Thank you for the tip. That must have done ya. Ah, right, yes. Ball mode. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> Almost forgot. Didn't quite. Now you're on fire twice. What are you gonna do? You're gonna fade into existence again. Okay. Mario, Mario, hello. Is this the second boss in this area? Yes. 
We already fought the army of bees. I guess if you count that as one. Ouch. That's a lot of damage you do as well. Oops, wrong button. You awake again already? How are you awake again already? What what let you do that? Oh, that's a new horrifying move you've got there. Made my made my hand show up. What did you do to do that? Okay. Um, is there any way to get through this? Yes. Cool. Great. Let's go. You are not stunned at all. No clanging, please. Thank you. Gosh, you keep giving me, making me worried. You're gonna real run from the money. Insert that's a lot of damage. Mean? Yeah, I know, I know. I realized it when I said it. Okay, phase four, the one that's going to horrify me. Now who's pressing the on switch to turn these on? Is it also him? Right. So with this, is it supposed to be that like I go, I don't know, I don't know. That was really difficult for some reason. Dude, where's your activation button? Ah! Oh, there's spores. And they're not going away. There we go. He is not stunned nearly enough. I just got to stun him multiple times. Noted. This is really worrying. I must admit, good boss fight. Was that all four? I think it might have been. Yes, it was. Well, then I'll just go right past your ugly dead face and unsuccessfully reached the other side of you, yeah? Sound good to you? Wonderful. Ah! Great! I'll do it in the other... like, other... priorities. <sighs> you son of a gun. You're not designing... you're not designed to make this easy, are you? Thank you for the... the bonuses. I don't think I need them just yet. Poor, my poor trigger finger elbow. Don't know why it's the elbow that's hurting, but it is. Don't clang it. Okay, thank you. I did the worst possible one last, I see, last time. Okay. Oh, that was actually a good boss fight. It gave me a real run for my money. about to become flowers, magically. Does this mean the level's complete because I sorted out the poison or is it just going to open up more? Probably that. Hello! Is that the screw attack? Is that what that, is that what it does? I should have, I should have scanned it. Oh well. Oh, it gives us levitation powers. T posing, because that's easy to animate.
Oh, it's the Varia suit. Never noticed. Dangerous areas of heat are now accessible. Ah. Additional data downloaded to inventory screen. Cool. I'll take that then. Thank you very much. Let's get going. You gonna show me this dangerous heat? Toxic scans negative. Water is free of poison. So that mean I can go to the other place now then? Because it's just water. Tangleweed. Plant life for basic sentience. We know. Uh, <laughs> that was quite a jarring tr loading transition. Like... Oh, that's a lot of blue. That's not quite how water works, but... It's good to know this still works underwater. Can I not go anywhere? I can. Kind of. It's very slow on loading, but it's going. Shoulder spikes. Is that what we ain't attained? Oh, we always had that. It's just Samus' design to a T, isn't it? There is more to this. Yes, there is a pipeline over here. How did I miss this? I feel like a robot, like, exploring the place. Did these explode? Yes, okay, that's how you do it. I don't actually know what these are. Unless I do. Ultra energy. Replenishes 100 units of energy. Wow. That's pretty good. What are you? A pulse bomb boo. Life form of raw energy. Periodically releases explosive segments from its body. Pulse bombus are energy beings, invulnerable to most known weapons. Electrical energy can harm them. However, they lack any intelligence beyond our instinctive attraction to other charged energy sources. Pulse bombus produce energy constantly. All excess energy is shed, regardless of who or what may be nearby. So, the, no damage done. You just gotta kinda dodge them like I did not just then. Noted. You didn't know you didn't notice them before? That's, that's fair. <gasps> Are we where we were before? No, it's just... Wait, we still don't have this ability, so we're about to learn it. Or we could just bounce at the very bottom. That works too. What is with the bees? Where's the proper bee boss, man? I'm done with them. Kill the queen, please. You are text. Oh, you too. War wasp hive, of course. Only vulnerable to heavy weaponry. I think I read this. Yeah. Chozo Law. Translated. The world of living things feels strange to us. We who have existed so long on the edges of time and space. It's clear now that we Chozo can never return to our dimension. Not while a great poison reaches ever further into the planet. It is so powerful, this creeping evil, that our wills are crumbling and our minds beginning to fail. And so... Before it is too late, we now make our last stand. We have begun to build a temple to contain this darkness. At its heart, we will place a cipher, a, mysti a mystical lock powered by 12 artifacts and filled with as much power as we Chozo can harness in our ethereal states. Even when we are done, it may be too late. Hmm? I might have just sprayed myself with water, I couldn't really tell. I was too busy trying to move. For randomly spawning bees. Is it because I was in this room too long? Maybe. Is this new? This is new. Okay. Magmore Caverns North granted. Please step into the hologram. Transport to Magmore Caverns North. So it's just a teleporter. Well then what's this? This is very portal-esque to me. Oh, I thought it was going to crush me. Never mind. Am I going the wrong way by going this way? Probably not. That's all new, so I'm taking it. Was it just a teleporting option? Maybe it was. This feels like where the water was before, but it might not be. No, it wasn't. This is a new room. So 
So like, presumably I can't just bomb this, right? No, I need to make it spin so that I open the- Nope, 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 I- Oh. Hello. Electrical pulses. Okay. Chozo, what do you have to say to me? Our sentry grows by the day. We Chozo know much of technology, but we have chosen to leave it behind on this journey. Our home here on Talon 4 will be a place of simplicity. Structures hewn from the stone, bridges woven with branches, hallways ca caressed by pure waters. We build around the ancient and noble trees, drawing from their strength and giving them our own in return. All that is wild will flow around us here. Our race will be just one more group of creatures in the knit of nature. It is our hope that we as such that such a state will bring with it great wisdom, a greater understanding of the nature of the universe, one, and a greater understanding of the nature of the universe. Once our city here is complete, we will peer inward and discover the truth. Hey, I have to write a poem for school before Monday, so I'm going to leave now. Fair enough, Aquatic Lion. I've probably already missed you because everyone else has said bye, but I'll see you later. You bet it's only a matter of time before someone brings up the B-movie joke for this zone. Eh, a bit too easy. That's the only issue with it. So like, am I supposed to jump in for this? That makes sense as well. If so, that's some that's some cool level design right there. But I'm unsure how to do this one. Like, how do you time that? Do you need? That doesn't do it. <laughs> None of this makes sense. There is a way to do it, I'm sure. And I imagine I can do it now? I don't need a bomb build up. Is it something simple? Should I know this? Because you can only jump up once, but how do you jump up twice and then in? I mean, it looked like I could almost make it anyway. Because that doesn't do double. I need to jump from that point, but how do I keep myself up that long? Hmm. That was kind of it? Okay, so it's like you, you shoot just before you jump. Okay, let's try that better, shall we? Aha! Look at me learning the game. And it just sort of threw me in there. I like that. I like that a lot. That felt real good. Then I worked that one out. Oh, it's the normal beetles. They're just like cool beetles, basically. Is this not anything interesting? Okay. No. What an unfortunately uninteresting room. Oh, hello. Lovely. And this takes me back into here. Ah, I see. But we don't really... Would I be better teleporting? Where is everything else? Like... We want to go here eventually. We don't know what that is. What was the, the, the north? Oh. Apparently we've been there, but we didn't do the thing there. Transport access north, which is where we wanted to go. I guess. Alright, so I'll go back on myself then and go back through that? I think I will do.
don't mind me. Flying on through. Okay. So this is where it takes us, I believe. I'll hop on in then. Mm -mm. It feels like a, a Ridley kind of moment, you know? I'm suspicious. The Magmore Cavern. Considering this is from the era of games right after the N64, it's pretty amazing that Nintendo managed to pull all this off on their first try at a 3D's Metroid game. You're right, I can't imagine, like, the level, that, uh, the, the character design on her, too. Like, I bet that must have been amazing to, like, experience for the first time. Like, how good she looks in 3D. I love the design. And it's easy, because it could look clunky if it wants to, because, you know, she's in a suit. Hello, I heard those symbols. Very dramatic symbols of yours. I know, I've heard this. No, I haven't. I was thinking something else. What a dramatic way to take us down. I... But why? What's down here? Is it just an, an interesting way to do it? Because the Chozo were against technologies, but not elevators? Okay. Here we go, scan them please. What are these damn things? Oh, it's a Shriek Bat, of course. Territorial Ceiling Dweller. Body temperature peaks at 121 centigrade. Shriek Bats have high internal temperature, making them easy to spot with thermal imaging. They roost on sea, uh, cave ceilings while hunting for small prey. Fiercely territorial, they dive from anything that wanders nearby. Goodbye. Hey, they're spawning on the ceiling. They're not always there, I'll have you know. I can really get behind this atmosphere. Symbolism. Good job. <laughs> Ominous chanting. What do you think the lyrics are that these guys have to sing? Oh, I think they stopped because I walked into this room. Save station. Oh. Was just the symbols. We'll catch up with you singers in a moment. Give us, hold on. Just. All right. Sorry for the break, there, kids. Come on, give us, give us out your your ominous chanting again, please. Even though it's actually the symbols. Very soft symbols, but that's that's the effect. With a with a softened drum beat, drumstick. That's the word. Hello, a grisby, subvolcanic carrion feeder. Carapace can be breached by missiles. This grisby carapace has been fused together by superheated air. This barrier stands up to everything but concussive blasts. Its intelligence is limited to instinct scavenging patterns. Instinctive. <gasps> So what, I have to use missiles on the damn thing? That's a shame. I only have so many. Well, I've got 15. And they give me some, so you know what? Cannot complain, I guess. Hello. We're now good with heat. Can we not just, like, step in this lava? Probably not. Whoops. That's not, that's not, la that's not missiles. Ugh. Yeah, that's still damaging. Even though it said I'm good at heat. Ah, shush. Energy levels. Who are you? A burrower. Obviously, who came up with this name? Tunneling Insect Predator. The burrower is similar to the beetle, but prefers to spend more time underground. It seeks seismic disturbances, then services to attack. The same as the beetle. It has enough cunning to realise when something is too large for it to maintain something or other. Beyond that, it's fairly ignorant. When it lacks its brains, it makes up with aggression. Well, that's fun. I see, so it like literally hops out at you and makes a mark on my visor. 
Samus definitely seems like a hardened character that, you know. You don't need to waste missiles, those guys are harmless, the Grizzlies. Oh, thank you for the tip. This theme I know. It's not, it's still ominous singing or chanting, sure, but like it's a bit less. What are you, you three-eyed thing? A magmor fire-breathing serpent that dwells in lava. you these are terrible names. Magmors prefer extreme heat zones and are susceptible to frigid attack forms. Sightless, they navigate to the lava currents using their sonar receptors. Magmors have a keen sense of smell, enabling them to pinpoint targets with startling accuracy. So just like keep your distance and you'll be fine. Did I need to use something stronger? Oh, I thought my I thought my it was my gun that was getting all um like my cannon laser whatever doodle was getting like heat 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 waves on it, but no, it was just him. What is this thing? A puffer! Unstable gas filled organisms will rupture on contact. Puffers will fill their bodies with lethal metavibrium gas and float about in search of food. If ruptured, the gas within is violently released. Despite their fragile bodies, puffers are aggressive hunters. The gas cloud they release upon death is often fatal to the creature that brings them down as well. Harsh. Problem solved. I see. The gas. Noted. I'm an idiot. Thank you. Not just the thing they release. Alright. Samus, you're really bad at this. Like, am I missing something here? No, I, I, okay. Is there another route I'm supposed to be taking? There is! I will do that then. <laughs> Maybe I need like a, a freeze. Ray, if I had to guess. You know what, can I go this way? Alright, that is also a no. It doesn't it doesn't like doesn't like me, does it? Can I just walk along this? This invisible wall is no. That's a pretty invisible wall right there. So much for having fire resistance, right? Uh, I don't know what it was what it was rambling about. I guess I should probably work out how to progress. Well, I imagine it is I just have to jump and do better at it. Did that hurt me? Did they hurt me? The 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 grizzlies there? What were these what were these uh puffers breathing in? Neurotoxin? You never know. There's a lot of there's a lot of portal similarities to this for some reason. Also, that that last saving sound effect just there was like nah, 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 reminds me of Gaster. Gaster? Gaster. Yeah, it's doing some damage. I'm pretty sure that's not the fire. You back? Of course you're back. Get out of here. How did that chop off your head? I have not a clue. So what, they're designed that you have to wait. That's some fun gameplay right there. Jumping off the wrong part of the platform, or ha! Yes, that was literally. Oh no! It's a scale. <sighs> okay. So would I want to weight it down at some point? Maybe I will. Hello. Want to pop up again? I'm pretty sure you can't hurt me from here. Okay, maybe you can, but it's cool. Thank you. So simple. Okay, <laughs> I was worried it just put me right back where I was before. It didn't. We're good. Bam. This too? Yeah. Okay, who, who? No, I do. I need this. Thank you. Ain't this fun. 
How is this poison? How is gas bad in this Varia suit, though? Like, it's literally gas. We have a suit. Like, if you're still breathing in this air, Samus, then it's not a very good suit. You know? I guess it's a bit more resistant, but even still, that doesn't look like a jump that we can do. It is. <laughs> Just about. It probably feels like there's something around there, but probably isn't. No. It said heat resistant, so fire would still do physical damage, possibly melting the suit. Okay. I guess, yeah. So we're not impervious, but... So like what? Are you supposed to pop out the ground or something? Or... Want me to get under you and burn you up? Thank you very much. And I guess he's a pothole I don't want to land in, huh? Like little dung beetle things. Interesting. Interesting way to show them off. Oh, alright, and they, they like collecting like ball shaped things. Interesting! A future mechanic. Uh oh. Steaminess. Look at that atmosphere on my, on my face. On my eyeballs. route we go in a moment there we are. I really appreciate that the ball form is like infinitely long it's just it's just enjoyable going around as a ball you know I have not found the entrance to it yet Hello. Am I to be concerned? No, no, just takes me back. Into their land. I need to do better at this. I'm very bad at this. Actually, I don't need to bother them that much, do I? Well, it felt like he disappeared for a minute, but otherwise, I think they're fine to be ignored. Yeah, it just sticks onto them. Gosh. Beep boop. Oh, that was not not blocked. Hello. Where are we going now, kids? Folks? People? Not in bull form is the answer. Did not like that. Take that. I guess that's what most of this this level in this game is. It's finding the secrets to get your expansive energy tanks or whatever. I mean, it reminds me of Mega Man in all honesty, the uh, energy tanks. Right, is there another place I'm supposed to go to? Let me turn back this way and see if it keeps going around. It does. Might have been just a, just been a bonus section though. No, no, no. That's it. No, that's the way back. All right, where are we going? Oh, ouch! That's not a fun. It's found the furnace again. Okay. Ouch! Hello, Debs. Welcome. Welcome, Debbie. Can I get out? Yes, just about. Let's go up there. Assuming I can? No, it doesn't actually look like I can. First person's a little bit weird for platforming, I must admit it's a bit like too close. But a third person Metroid might be a bit weird. To people. I don't know, maybe it could work. 
this, the 2D, 2D games were kind of third player, third person. Okay. There is a way to go up. There must be. I guess just don't go down. Just go back to the beginning of the room. Uh, that looks to be the case. Yeah, that's a lot more reachable than I thought it was. Now, is there a thing here? Oh, scales, that's what it is. Ah, okay. What? Ah, thank you very much. Okay, that's actually a lot going on here. Auto defense turret uses missiles to break. Oh, use missiles. So it's not new, but I just hadn't scanned it before. Gotcha. That didn't hit. Thank you. I was too far away for it to register the hit. Like, come on. Yes, that that's exactly how that works out. Typical. Oh, of course, that was going to happen, and the wrong button. And just add all of those together and you get an almost dead Samus. Lovely. Always wanted to know how. I'll be sure to tell Ridley or pray. Wow, I'm doing awful. Okay. Doorway first. If it wants to open, you know, it doesn't have to. Such a natural bridge that Chozo have created. Unless it's the point, the logic that something else has come here as well. Which I guess could be the case. Like pirate stuff. Again, doesn't look traversable. But it's not. Like, it. Uh, there's logic in my reasoning here. Hwah! Nope. Alright, I'll come back another time. I'm not wasting my deaths on this. Let me at least save first. Is there even a safe state anywhere near us? Doesn't feel like it. Don't worry about bits and twitch. Oh, of course you'll come back. And you still have, like, impeccable aim. How are you both not registering death? Come on. Don't let me lose to cheapness. Oh, yes, I forgot about the gas. Ain't I a, ain't I a genius? You. Oh, does it actually take two? Is that the point with them, maybe? I think it always did that. Maybe. That's moving, isn't it? No? Okay, I heard something moving and I assumed it was the bridge. Okay, scan me some things, please. Immersion pistols are leeching power from the magma pools as planned. Geothermic a uh, thermal power source is promising. Recommend energy command deactivate central dynamo and switch to geothermal power at once. Geothermal power routing to this station is complete. Unstable magma flow is a, is a concern. Remove tower from theothermal uh, geothermal grid if fluctuations exceed safety levels. Local crystal formations possess low phason residue. They do have high value to the monks of Gra Grondheim. However, recommend processing a crystal for that market once phase on operations cease. Yes, that's right. There are, like, possibly pirates doing experiments here, and that's why everything's like this. I'd kind of forgotten that element, because that was, like, at the very beginning of this level. Yes. Was that this level? It doesn't feel like it. Felt all rainy and grassy there, but no, it, it is the same place. I did that wrong. Oh, wow. Okay. Way to punish us. 
Youch. I'm going back and saving, thank you very much. That just ruined that just ruined that completely. I guess that's the point. It's supposed to be hard, you get one go. Or it's coming No, they're spawning back, that's what's going on. Thank you. The dolphin the dolphin is chugging at loading a lot. I am I am, my apologies. I can't I can't, you know, do much. How do I get back without dying? There! Oh, that was wrong. Are you kidding me? I feel like we last saved a long time ago. Like at the beginning of the Magmore Caverns, probably. Well, Fang. Your purpose is re-realized. Re There's a long way to go, man. Yeah, see, these guys definitely do damage. Look how much damage I took from them. They do 10 damage. Including knocking you into lava. I, I can't even lock on them when I'm that close. Oh, that's what I was... This was, like, the closest thing to a boss I was thinking of. There's also a thing up top there that I didn't notice last time, so, I mean, it's nice that we're back here, I guess, technically, to learn all this. How have you got so much HP? Doesn't want to lock onto it. Alright, apparently it's just decoration, huh? I'm not a fan of all like the extra backtracking and the the punishing for doing something wrong. You know, it's a bit disheartening. The saves are too rare. Is it attempt to like pad out the game, perhaps? I don't know. Back? Are you kidding me? Or is that just? Did I just miss one last time? No, I forgot about that guy. This part of the game is not fun. I'm gonna go back on myself. It's not fun. Doing? I haven't dealt with that crap. Come on. Are you kidding me? Get me out of the damn lava! Makes me wish I'd found more health earlier. Just so I don't have to deal with this all the time. Lava man, it burned. You're correct. And these guys are all going to spawn back again. The moment I save. It's a Dark Souls effect. I have to like, keep going back if I don't do it without losing any HP. Hello, Tramunas. How am I? I'm pretty good. Apart from, like, I'm actually really enjoying this game. Apart from the parts where it's making me do everything twice, if not more. I'm enjoying how open and explorative it is, because I love that in my games. Story and exploration. And this has at least exploration, if not some story. But it's a bit hidden, but like, I can get behind it all. Definitely my kind of game. Come on, dude. Get out of my face. Thank you.
Well, it's nice that the guy tried to be involved by shooting me with fire, but didn't really work. Hey, Frozen. Just got in, got a bit carried away while playing F1 2018. FIFA 1? F oh, no, the Russian. What did you lost? You mean, what did you miss? Uh, well, I was going to say we're still in the tutorial level, but this isn't really a tutorial level anymore. We're just exploring more of this world. We're finding and getting more upgrades. We've done a boss. Oh, yes, one big boss. I think it's going good. Like, is there a way to do this? Yes, this is another one of those jumps that doesn't look doable. And then it is, because it's low gravity and all that. Oh, God, this again? That's a long way back, it feels like. And you, I, I land right into you. Come on. Dudes. Ah. Oh. Why does I like, why do I stick to you? Who did, who, who allowed for that? Eh? Thank you. Just get out of my face. Please. Right, we need to get that uh, missile upgrade again, so we'll do that right now. It's not even in there. I, I don't know where it is. I'm slightly lost, but I'll make my way. There it is. One that, the one that matters. All right, get me there quick, please. I know we could, we've discovered the furnace for the second time. I'll get there eventually. This is very close quarters. And this room's just here to be dramatic, isn't it? There's no damage here. Thank you. Let's read you. Yes, yes, we know, we know. You're crashing everything and you're not connected to anything, so you're not actually teaching me anything new. As far as I can tell. Uh, we can't die. We're fine. Can't die here, anyway. Okay, I was good luck. Am I in the wrong place? No, no, I'm good. Sorry. Right. We've lost a little bit of health, but otherwise we're mostly okay. So let's just go back to wherever we were, wherever the starting spot was, which I guess is up there. And then we'll try not to die in lava this time for over the top punishment, yeah? Do what we can, anyway. Any problem with vertical platforming? You know, it's it's horribly un unpleasant when you mess it up. I guess part of the logic with these enemies is you might want to like not shoot them, so then you, you just have to dodge their gas. But... Right, was this what killed me last time? I felt like it was. Yes, because of you, son of a guns. Maybe you do just need two. Yes, you do. You just need two. It's not, it's not a loading error thing. You just need two. Okay. That makes the game a little nicer to deal with. As much as you're going to spawn back. Bit of a shame that they used two, but uh, better than nothing, I guess. Um, 
so let's just not deal with those doors. We'll come back to them later when we can save. I remember like ignoring the door for something. Wasn't wasn't an upgrade. I remember that. I think. So I'm just gonna keep going. I'm very behind on chat, do excuse me. Don't even try me, thank you very much. So I went backwards for some reason, didn't I? I wanted to go back. Why did I want to go back? Because there was nothing else to see here? I'd scan this because there's the bridge. Oh, any reporting signs of magma predation or predator activity to security hall. Cool. There's that over there as well. Gosh, we were miles behind, weren't we? Ah, that's why we were punished for that. Well then I'm not dealing with you. Problem solved. How to make me skip your game in one go- Oh, shoot. Are you kidding me? Alright. Not a fan. I do not like that level design. Maybe for the end of the game, sure. And even then, I'd, I'd expect a save file right before, you know? Don't tell me the last level doesn't have a save. That's just harsh. Access to Fendrana Drifts North granted. Thank you. Next area then. The game kind of reminds you of Bayonetta since the third game is coming by the way. Would you consider playing the first two? Yeah, sure. Oh, we've made it to Iceland. Iceland. Oh. Cool. Okay. We didn't fight the boss in Magmore, did we? I don't think we did. Well, can I even go through this at the moment? Yes, I can. Okay. Well, let me find a save. There's a save right here, isn't there? No. No, there isn't. There was an E near here. Okay. I'm going to deal with this anyway. Oops. It's the one that I wanted. Okay, cool, the charge shot does do something. I was like, it never seems to ever be used. Okay. What do we got? This game is one big level. Open world, full of all the, all the different world types. Gotcha. Quite pretty. We have one that's closer. Yeah. This platform is kept aloft by a gas based propulsion system attached to its underside. Okay. Man, this is very big and open. Oh, I guess it's an outdoor area, so it makes sense, but like, I'm liking this. I'm liking this atmosphere that I get to just sort of traverse around, you know? This is good fun. Ugh. Could definitely, like, chill with this game. That's not a pun. <sighs> Crystallite, Territorial Cold Weather Scavenger. Why is this world got all of its seasons and weather an elevator away. The shell of a crystallite reflects beam weapons and can only be cracked by a concussive blast. They hang upside down in an ice cave during the larval stage. Moisture runs off its body, which forms a hard ice shell, which the crystallite retains for the rest of its life. So the beam weapons reflect, but does this count as a beam weapon? Possibly. Well, I don't want to explode it with the rock missile, because I don't have that many. So we'll just go by. Hello! Been waiting for you for ages! In that case, I might go back to the fire area and find ourselves a boss. 
That might be my 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 plan then. Seeing that it is just a bunch of separated, like level tropes. But I'm happy that I'm here. <laughs> I played with my brother Metroid Prime. We hated ice level. Oh man. Okay. Well, good job. We're going back to Magmore Land, the Magmore Caves, or whatever it was. Again, kind of a generic title, Magmore, but you know, whatever. You love winter, it's your favorite season? It's the season now! We've just come into officially winter, I think. Well, by month at least. So you better enjoy it. You got burned by a cigarette because I was young playing Resident Evil Zero and the opening scared me so much I ran into it? That's quite the story. <laughs> Oh, right. I have a struggle getting out, aren't I? Well, at least I seem to have mastered this move, so. I'm gonna try it again. Thank you. This miraculously didn't break at that time, for some reason. It takes two hits, I guess that's why. For some reason. Nice! Thank you very much. Don't put me in the lava. Thank you. Thank you for not. I'll accept that. I'll have to do that again if I die on this way out, but that's cool. So, what, we do want the other door that I dodged before? I guess we do. But a whole extra 100 HP actually will make the game a little bit nicer for me. <laughs> Hopefully. Logically, yes. I mean platforms above us, but it didn't really feel like it. Right, so you don't jump from here. Alrighty! We are jumping from here! Thank you. Mist of... Oh, missiles that I don't like, that's what it is. More turrets. Did I like... Did I quit and want to come back? Uh, was I looking for a save over here? I just didn't want... No, I didn't know how to do this. It's just a difficult jump, isn't it? That's all. Well, we've already just saved, so we're good. You don't think there is a boss in lava? Really? Weird. Well, I want to see where this goes. And I did the jump, so we're doing it. Just get out of here, dude. What are you? Okay. Ugh. Also, I saw that. I'll talk about it in a moment in chat. Don't worry. Alright. Okay, thank you for wasting all my missiles. I get it. But the ball, ball thing. Don't you dare kick me into Are you kidding me? What is with this punishing? This game! Too much, dude! How do you get around this? How do you get around this? This is some crap. And he's gonna bump me as well, like. Freaking. Oh! I can do everything right, but not that. I have an extra 100 HP, and it's not doing anything. Thank you. Um, so, the question that I wanted to ask about was, is, is Biscuit Barrel coming to America? You don't live in Austria anymore, so it's hard to see you. Um, no. We are only, we're still a small. America costs money, you know? Um, if we got the opportunity, we would love to. There are things going on with Biscuit Barrel where we're like, we'll be doing more fringes at Edinburgh this year, and I, we're also going to Brighton this year, like in April time, whenever Brighton Fringe is. But also, what will be quite exciting is soon enough we're doing like a, we'll be doing like an online presence. We'll have an online presence. Um, it hasn't been formally publicly announced yet, so excuse me, we've only just announced it to the rest of the team the idea and how it works. 
But uh, what we'll eventually have is weekly uploads of Biscuit Barrel on our Facebook page, and then all our social medias will link into it. Like there'll be a, we've got we've got some ideas for like um, Twitter and Instagram, and like some audience in, uh, interaction with all that. Um, don't worry, you're not in a sketch or anything, but you you're a. Uh, you're like, you'll, you'll have a, pr an, an, a presence in some form. Oh, was that it? Cool. I guess that's all this place has to give us. We'll go to Iceland again. Um, but yeah, so there'll be there'll be some online content for Biscuit Power, which is very good because you guys are online-y people. And I'll be able to link it on my YouTube and hopefully get it more places. You know, as much as getting five stars and, a, and a, a, an award is not enough. <laughs> so yeah, there you go. Not going on America, but we will be going onto your screens real soon. And by real soon, I mean at least after a month, because we still need to actually record the damn things and write them and do all sorts. We've got a lot of pre-planning to do first. These freaking aimbot machines. I know I'm one too, but still. I mean, I know I'm not machine, but you know what I mean. This is a very tough game. I guess it is the first in the series, so like it's it's the theme early GameCube games and Nintendo 64 games, built to just be disgustingly difficult in places. Um, I was going to say, where am I moving? You know what, I guess I'm going to just go to the Iceland straight away. I'll fast travel, it's cool. Who needs an extra? I'll go back for the extra tank. I'm not getting missiles, I guess. Screw you, Beetle. Screw you, Beetle. I hate the, the Beetles are my least favourite enemies. Right now. This game is a mess, what is happening? It's just punishing, that's all. Right, we're going for the energy tank, because I could really do with that extra energy. And we're going on getting on with our days and our lives. If there's no boss, then I'll try and find one here. That's not good. You're not allowed to go through rapid body changes in temperature. So going from ice to coal, uh, ice to cold, ice to lava, in this speed, your body would rupture, man. Probably. Like in Bioshock Infinite, at the beginning you go into heaven, like way up into a city in the sky. You can't travel upwards that fast. The difference in oxygen, you know, the, ox the air pressure, and uh, I've forgotten exactly what it is, but you your body can't contain it. Uh, you find going up Mount Everest. It's because you do it slowly. Oh, that just about works. Thank you. I've learnt the game. I can do my thing. Must have doubly messed it up the first time then if, it, if I managed to hit it twice. Yeah, I guess I just didn't press it when I went up again. The first time? Oh. Dramatic looking in an elevator. There's an energy tank in the Magmor workshop. Oh, did I get it? Uh, possibly. I didn't. I don't know. The, I don't know the rooms. I might have done, but possibly not because I've only got three. I might do some backtracking, exploring later. Maybe in another stream. We'll see. Like, it might be a matter of I'll just play this game as I'd go now, and then, like, towards the end of the game, I'll be like, right, let's get everything. Like, all the things I missed. Because I know I've missed a lot in the first area, but because I didn't like, get it as much. Or I just didn't want to, or I didn't have the things, you know? Didn't have anti-gravity ball. Oh, yeah, it's only going to show Iceland, so it's not going to show me much. Woohoo! That didn't work. Screw you, Beetle. You're not even a beetle, you're a nice thing. You do the same thing. So you're all beetles to me. Fucking reflective. I want to use my missiles on you. Too small and insignificant. I've only got 16. What is this? 
blast shield over door is secure. Shield controls are elsewhere. Oh, okay. Cool. It's a bit nicer. Thought it needed a third type of gun. A flicker bat, scavenger with optical camouflaging that renders it invisible to the naked eye, even though we can see it. Flicker bats are deceptive creatures. The only way to track them is reliably is with X-ray imaging. They fly ceaselessly, hunting insects and other small prey that float on the air currents. Flicker bats tend to fly in cyclical hunting patterns using primitive sonar to navigate. Let's see. Oh, I guess they are invisible, but then they're not. No, they're not. They're not invisible at all. But the, it won't lock onto them, I guess. Okay. Interesting. I guess. Alright. Well, at least there's no lava at the bottom of this. To completely deter me from progressing. That's what I'm after. Oh. Classic harpy ish sound effect. Um, what is it you say again? Oh. Gas based. So it can't be. Maybe. I imagine it can be loosened. Screw you, Beetle! Okay, I can go underwater here, which is nice, even though it's icy cold. Okay. No. Not how that does things. Noted. That's not really a platform, is it? No. I do love GameCube snow effects. They're just the simple, the simple, simpleness of this. I like it a lot. It reminds me of Mario Party 4. Probably because I just played it. But, you know, same era. So it makes sense. Also, I guess I can go through. Well, no, it's locked off. Let's just go swimming for a moment. Maybe that'll teach me something new if it goes deep enough. Anything under here to see? No, it doesn't look like it. There's a couple fish that I presumably can't even kill. Okay. Hummity, hummity, ha. There are so many extra slots on this HUD that I could be using, but I haven't earned them yet, so... I want to be over there, I imagine, but it won't let me. This level reminded you of Hatchet, Ratchet and Clank. Fair enough. Haven't played that game. It's not an emulator, is it? It's a, it's a PlayStation only game, isn't it? It's not a Nintendo game thing, which would be the reason I probably haven't played it. Um, so I, I guess that does go down. That'd be my only logical thought. Okay, let me try this again. I can't even get close to the other one. It'd be nice if I could work out how to interact with these platforms. Or I could just do that. The game doesn't like loading all these different <laughs> dry and wet lands, so please stop doing that to yourself, game. Stop knocking me off this platform. You know what, actually, yeah, I should, probably should get you out of my way now. Yeah, I know. Just, just go. So... You give me that because that you use them, of course. You are not going to move if I do that or if I do this. Can you be interacted with at all? Gas-based. We don't have a gas-based thing. You think there's one more? There's one door you can enter. Let me check the map. There's that. There's this. That looks a bit high. But there's that up there, which is the door that's shut. And the safe spot, which doesn't have another door. No, it doesn't. Okie dokie. So there's a door over there, and there's a door up here that it won't let me get to, right? Yeah. Which is probably from the other way or something. Um. There! That doesn't look like, I guess that's kind of a platform there. Look at me, just, again, it's always ob observation, but then that doesn't look like it's steppable anymore. So you know what, maybe I'm wrong. 
Yeah, that's pretty wrong to me. It's a PlayStation series. There you go. There's a boss that's found randomly here called Shigoth. Randomly? Like it just appears? Interesting. Anyone else got another tip for me? How am I constantly getting stuck? English United Kingdom Local Experience Pack just got installed. I have no idea what that is, but good to know. Now I get to know how to experience the UK, because I don't live here. Right, it's not a lot I can do. I am uh, I'm a tad stuck. One nice save at the very least. I'll just save for a moment. What does the Switch lack? For me, achievements, even though those games like Dizgia 5 have some in-game trophies. Ah, I'm not fussed about trophies. Um, what does it lack? It's not a ton. I don't know, I don't know. It, uh, I have to come back on that. I feel like it is missing something, but I can't, rem can't remember what it is that I think it's missing. Okay. What Metroid is this? Oh, I thought you said Met what Metroid is she, as in a joke. This is Metroid Prime 1. The first in 3D. That's why it's a bit, it's a bit... I don't know, learning curve, a bit chong chompy? Chompy sound, makes, sounds like a, a good verb, for, uh, now, adjective for it. So like, how am I still struggling? <laughs> These platforms, do not switch to move, you, you do not. Right. Uh, actually, that almost looks like it's doable. No. Right. <laughs> that almost worked. Oh, look at that elevation. <laughs> like, I'm not an that. I'm probably am an idiot, but like I'm not an idiot, right? <laughs> That is locked, and I can't go under that way yet, doesn't seem. Up top there is way up there. Like, can I just jump up from there maybe? Is that all it is? I feel like no, but maybe I'm making assumptions on how these other platforms work. Or how I get to them. Ouch. Is there another almost impossible jump? Yeah, this looks like a pretty impossible jump to me. Like, next level impossible. Not gonna happen. Do you know at the end of the whiskey bottle there's happiness? By the way, what are you drinking? I did not. I still don't believe it. But, blackcurrant. It's what I always drink. <laughs> Try to jump through the hole with the bull form. What, the, um, the one in the water here? Because I already tried that. does not do. Um, unless you're referring to another hole in which I do not remember. I'm gonna look around in case you did mean something else. Also it says you can only damage it when it uses its frost breath of... Uh, are you talking about the bosses? Because if so, I uh, technically spoilers but I'm not reading them. But I'm also a bit lost on the conversation. But I guess I shouldn't be reading a conversation. That's a logic point you could take, I guess. There is not a hole here. Hmm.
There is totally something being missed here. Like, what is the platform that gets you up there? I feel like that goes down. You step on it, you go up and you can jump it. But the game doesn't seem to be lining up to tell us that. This is not the way, right? Uh, am I supposed to be here? This also just doesn't feel right. Nothing lines up. Nothing lines up. Did you just send me a, a January meme in December? You should feel ashamed of yourself. While I'm just rolling at a ball going nowhere. My apologies for not getting this, but it seems everyone else seems fairly stumped as well. Even by looking through my eyes, like it just doesn't seem very clear. Maybe there is more in this deep world. And I'm just struggling to see. Nope. Nothing makes sense. It's open somewhere else, so there's an activation key there, right? That's what it said, right? That's what I'm looking for. Shield controls are elsewhere in the area. So I'm looking for controls in this room. Which I would have thought would have been in the... Uh... So I'm looking for a black button. I'm not looking to go anywhere. So I need to be exploring up the sides. That's my issue. Okay. Is this scannable? Grating has become brittle from temperature fluctuations. Large traces of radion de detected. Okay. That looked pretty metallic to me, but okay. Thinking, you know, could not be destroyed. Uh, uh, that looked like a do not pass kind of thing. The door directly above has been unlocked. I'm glad I worked it out myself, but not happy with that puzzle. If anyone went to look at the guide, my apologies that I worked it out just as you went to look. It's weird as well that the bomble didn't destroy it. Because I tr specifically tried. You know what? I'm not going to go through. No, I got plenty of health. It's fine. Scatter Bomboo! Pulsing tendrils of energy extend from the creature's body. Like all bomboos, these creatures can only be harmed by electrical energy. Proximity to these life forms may result in electrical bias or interference. It's possible to avoid engaging scatterbomb boots by rolling into the morph ball and slipping between the rotating energy streams. There you go. Which is just kind of timing and luck, huh? Yep. Bad on both of those. Uh, 
That's a cool effect, but um, excuse me? What is happening in my kitchen? Hello. <laughs> You people and your weird conversations. Oh, good good to know it moved at the last minute. A baby she-goth. Now I know what the boss is. <laughs> Glacial Predator. Ice shell protects vulnerable dorsal enemy. Uh, air, area? Area. Young she-goths grow a resilient shell of ice on their backs, which serve to protect a layer of vulnerable flesh. With this being their only weak point, baby she-goths will turn quickly in order to not allow predators the opportunity to strike at their backs. Powerful hunters, they fire bursts of ultra-cold gas at potential prey, then feast on their frozen victim. Fun. Gosh. Ugly thing, ain't ya? Of course the other one's gonna die before the other one does nothing. Go on. Gosh, you have a lot of HP. Anyone ever said that before? I guess that's what I'm supposed to be using against them. Is that the hit? Is that supposed to be the hint? Yes. That is a bit easier, I must admit. Especially because they gave me the missiles. And now just the simple sounds of Samus jumping. and beetles. It's not my gameplay unless I'm getting hurt by beetles the whole time. Ice Burrower. Same thing, but frozen. Hardy life form, the Ice Burrower has adapted to the frigid climate of Fendrana. It spends most of its time tunneling through the frozen soil, but will occasionally surface to attack passerby. Passes by. Congratulations, you did it. Not done with him. <laughs> oh, dude. Oh, that did take him out. Under the ground, I guess? Things are not fun to fight. Get out of here, please. Thank you. Oh, we're here now. What was, the, what, was, what was the purpose and point? I guess I was supposed to go the other way. Like, what did I? What did I earn from that? A pathway here. I don't know what I gained. What was the cost? What did we what did we achieve? What what is with your like perception, dude? Going back on the path that we were already just on. But, like, what? What am I to achieve? I'll go the other way. Ah, oh, cool, I got rid of both of them. That deals with that problem nicely. So, like, what's this? A thing? That's the entrance. So, what's this bike? Oh, was it to get to a platform? That would make sense, like an, an upper top platform thing? Maybe? I don't really see it. Yes, that was, that was a path. 
would have wanted me to jump back down again. I'd like to see a Metroid Prime Maker. That'd be fun. Seems like a Metroid Prime room right there. If I may say so myself. You're gonna wake up to a ball rolling around. Light sleepers, I see. Oh, hello. How about no? Thank you. Oh, great. Nice. For once, I timed it right. But it won't let me do it twice. shouldn't have done that, you know? That was a thought. <gasps> There's a lot of enemies around me. I want to stay on the upper path. I can tell that now. So I will. Beetle, I thought you weren't there. Oh, great. This guy's also going for me now. Platforming realignment successful. Well, great. <laughs> I don't know what all the rumblings about, so I'm just going with it. Is it like they're timed platforms? <gasps> Anti gravity? Boost ball. I don't know this. While in morph ball, press and hold B to charge the ball. Release after charging to get a speed boost. Additional data downloaded. Sweet. Where am I to go? That doesn't look like a boost ball path. It's, it's got stairs on it, you know? Oh, I can keep moving while I've got it. Interesting. That was not much of a speed boost. Nice. <laughs> That's specifically not... This is specifically not boosting me. Or not the place to boost. Hello. HP do you have to be able to take on a missile like that? Like, really? Thank you. What a wonderful sound you have. What a wonderful voice. Like, is that all the boost that you get? It's gotta be more. Because that's not gonna get you anywhere. Oh, it's not as high, low down as I thought it was. You guys memeing in the chat? Is that what's going on? Is that what I've got to deal with? <laughs> Playing through a simple chill game of Metroid Prime 1. You're all here sending out all your memes all at once. Okay, it's so like, I'm a little more lost than I thought. Does it want me to boost up the walls? That makes more sense. Let's do that. Okay, so there's a bit going on. Cool. Alright. I appreciate this now. A little bit more. Not a ton, but it's something. Woo. You know what? Get out of here, beetles. Thank you. Oh, it didn't even give me what missiles I used up. Okay. Cool. I get the concept. Let's go. Hey, gave it twice in a row as well. <laughs> Didn't mean to startle you like that. Good job. What's the purpose of this? 
Oh. Ouch. I'm gonna go save if I can. Oh, was that what? Was it an energy spike? Why is it always happening with a lag spike? You're causing them. How have you found something? And I'm completely different. Re Why do you keep pointing me to the furnace? I guess I might go in the wrong way. Is that their way of saying it? Well, I'll get to it eventually then. Let me go save real quick. Yowch. Oh, oh, oops. I thought there was a dragon then, but it was just a smudge on my screen that was moving with the... Oh, it is a dragon, but still. It's Skeleton Ridley. Because they didn't want to load his details. In the sh shadow. Okay. Cool, so I'm going the right direction now, which is nice. Technically. And what, do I use the ball to get up everywhere? Probably not. But, at the very least I'm saving, so that I don't die. And I don't lose all this progress that I've suddenly made. Where was Paper Mario? My Smash roster guesses? Paper Peach is a spirit. That might mean something. Possibly? Uh, it's more a matter of like, I've done... I, for Smash 4, I made a, a predictions video that had 50 characters in it. Paper Mario was there. It was just a matter of like, I was like, I've p predicted him in the past, wanted to predict someone new and someone... I didn't believe it. Because he didn't appear in Smash 4, I kind of lost faith. Basically. Hence why we're back to where we are. With my simpler things. Like if I said more characters, yeah, Paper Mario. Could definitely get behind that. But then I'm also the logic of, will they really add another Paper Mar uh, Mario character? Like, we just got Pir Piranha Plant as DLC for the Mario series. You know, having two out of six DLC slots, Mario, might be a bit much. And I'm like, well, what's more iconic for gaming? Crash Bandicoot is 90s. Lara Croft is 90s, a bit more, you know, you know what I mean? Paper Mario, he's there, but he's not as representative of something, I would have said, or tried to argue. I didn't know it was the kind of the point I was going for. Okay, so like, what am I to do here now with the beast boost ball? Maybe not. Mario Mario, what was the bit goal? The bit goal was, I think, 150 pounds in the end. Hopefully get me to the end of the year. It's like not a giant, well, it is kind of a giant goal. I might bring it down. I might do instead bit goals for individual streams rather than for a whole year. Seems a bit too much to have such a tiny percentage and it's less satisfying. So uh, we'll see. But yeah, so that's like, what, 1,500 bits? 15,000 bits? 15,000? I can't do the math on it. I think 15,000 bits. It's a lot. My apologies. Um, I have to run through all of this, don't I? To get going to where I was. Fine. Nope. Oh, there's a secret door there. Like a room. But I'll come to it another time. I uh, barely even see it on the map, but okay. I know it's there now, so I got that going for me. What is in there? Don't look like much. Maybe the same as the last one. Might even be the same assets for all I know. Gosh, they really like me using these missiles, don't they? Okay, so we're back here now. They don't want me to dash up that, do they? I feel like no. So I'm gonna go back to the door that was open here, or available here. It's through the next piece, and then it's up on the left, noted. Jump on it? 
the room? I don't, I don't, want, I don't want you referring to that. Jesus, hello! You dash right at me, why don't you? Or, you know, just do that and then go right past me, that's cool. Right, so I want to be on the upper platform, which I can do with my new speed ball here, maybe? Yes. Looks like, no, no, of course not. That just makes too much sense. Also, the map works fine in this room. Interesting. Oh, look at that smoothness. Weird, I guess it was just that level, the earlier ones. Alright, it'd be nice if I could do that. <laughs> there we go. Maybe that's another way out. That's probably the case then. Well, I'm going to try a couple more things here still. There's all this room left to do something. Is it just a big room for the sake of being a big room? Like, doubtful. That's a powerful back you got there. Be a shame if you lost it. Thank you. Okay. So there's this. Hello, you. <sighs> you don't like me platforming a lot, do you, game? Oh, hello! A welcome surprise. Chose the script translated. None of who, none know if our temple, the cradle, will prove powerful enough to contain this evil forever. How can we chose it? Hope for it to remain intact when that which it guards writhes in the darkness growing always stronger. The fate of this world rests with the gathering of artifacts we call the Cypher, but even it is not all powerful. It is strong, yes, an enchanted hole made of twelve links, still it is finite in its reach, and we who guard it are slowly succumbing. When our vigilance crumbles away from madness, the Cypher will be exposed and the fate of Talon IV will be beyond our influence. Fun. How get there? Jump no do, jump may do. Not with this... This. Maybe here? Not really. Too far. No do. I, I couldn't even step on it. It was like I had an invisible wall going around it. Come on. Do you want me to do a bull jump over it somehow? I can try, but I, I'm doubtful. Or I'll just do that, that works. Ah, no. That's not how that works. What even is in there? Was there actually anything up there? Let me check. Again. Getting lost by my own first person view, but that's cool. Um, not a thing. It's a doorway, it's a path, so I do need to be there, but I can't... This isn't the place to dash, is it? It doesn't feel like it. It's not much of a ramp. No. Oh. Alright, I'll do a bull one, then check. Ads had the ultimate power, you were saving up 400 bits, and then it drops this on you? What did it drop on you? Is your head okay? That was a terrible joke. Excuse me, just ignore it happened. I'm getting stuck and lost and puzzly. My mind is not coming up with the best jokes. Now you need to do some platforming to the temple where you where you found the save. Okay. Okay. Where I found the save. Cool. I will do that then. But I want to try this first. Nope. All right. Gave up. So we are supposed to do from the top to the uh, the temple place. Gotcha. Thank you for the tip, though. Right. Oh! From there, I guess. Makes a lot of sense. 
I see. That's a lot of money that an advert just gave you, Mario Mario. 10,400 bits? That immediately does 75% of the goal of the amount of bits I was hoping to have by the end of the whole year. I've got a month left to do another 25%, but wow. Again with your Hara Hara Toriya sequels. Well, it wasn't the sequel the first time, but you get what I mean. I'm glad that I understood what it meant as well when I first read it. Thank you very much. That's some good luck. 400 you worked hard for, and then 10,000 it just chucked on you? Are you sure? Thank you very much. That's a lot of money. That's all I can say. <laughs> Am I supposed to use the boost here? Start to suspect we won't see Death 7, but hey, at least I've got my puns. Yeah. You got that going for you. I hope you enjoy. Did I go the wrong way? Like, how do you platform to there? Or did I misinterpret it? To the temple where you found the safe. This is, looks pretty temple to me. Any other rooms here? Any other doors? No. Unless they want me to just actually do the speed boost up to that point. Which looks possible, because even then, where do you jump from there? And I did get up there. Need the speed boost to get to this point, I guess. And then the rest you do yourself. You're something. Hold on, how did I get up there again? Maybe spin dash? <laughs> Very Sonic-y of us. Oops. Oh! Oh! That makes like a ripple in the water. Interesting. Um, anyway. Okay. If I, know, if I could do anything right, that'd be good. I know. Is this count as a ramp? Somehow? Does not look. We will get Death 7, don't forget about some of the boss. Sizz. Yeah. I'm stuck again. Can someone give me a tip? Like how? How does any of this work? I don't even see how the path goes to him. To this temple. It says I need to do some platform. Like, I need a 3D map so I can see the actual platforms. That's what I need. I mean, that was actually kind of close. Have I saved since I've gotten the spin ball? Possibly not. I'm going to. Bring back the Beatles. Not the singers. That sounds like Portal, actually, the way the doors open. Hey, hey, there's my name. You have to get the double jump boots first. Okay. I will keep exploring. Where is that? Because we've gone through all this path now. From what I can tell. So do I have to go backwards? To progress through the Weiss area? Am I done with ice? I can't go any further? Is that what I'm looking at right now? Also, hello, Ab Green. AB Green? How does this... I guess so. I guess we can't do the ice area because I haven't gotten the things. There's loads of stuff earlier on that I haven't done. Um, like, okay. Hold on as well. Okay, so yeah, there's a big chunk there. And it goes all the way that way, which we somehow... Oh yeah, okay, that makes sense. Oh, is this upside? No, it's not upside down. Um... 
Magmore. We haven't done nearly enough, have we? Oh, we've done all of it. Excuse me, it was just a long path. Like a, an in-between area, huh? Okay. Then there's Chozo Ruins, with the chunky map. It wants me to go to the furnace. That's what's going on. Can I not... Can I teleport... There's no teleporting, is there? No, it just says transport to it. And also, I didn't take that. The Talon 4 overworld thing, did I? Maybe I did, no. I think you can find them in the lava map, or in the first one where you meet the giant beetle. Okay. We'll do our last little... We'll, we'll explore a new area. We'll see where it takes us. That will be the plan. We've only got an hour left of the stream, but if I find a boss, I might finish on that, because then it's a natural climax, rather than just exploring and having that be a random end. But okay. The full game is open and ready for us to fight. Even though we don't have everything. I specifically couldn't do everything in the ice level, but I get how the game works now. The game has started. There's not another world to go to. We're exploring this one. Phase on four. Talon four. Excuse me. Yes, we got the energy tank. We don't have the missile from this one, though. Which would be quite nice if we could get. Whoa, that's a lot of damage we're taking. I know, insert mean here. Patience, it does not like at all, huh? Dude, dude! Get oh yes, you're a ball thing, I forgot about that. You're gonna punish me like hell for even being here. Yeah, alright, you know what, maybe we're not going to the out of the ice level. Bombs! Make me jump! And then they're all gone by the time I get to this freaking guy. I hate the, uh, you know what, I hate the level level. I'm not even going to go back to the, the freaking... Can I seriously not jump up onto this platform? Thank you. Skip that then. I might have timed that just right. Well, the bits that I can do, I can do really well. If I don't jinx myself again in some twisted way. Like, easy. I remember I was scared of this room once. I'm set. Now, I know this is how this is going to go. But I'm doing it again anyway. But I'm not going into the door this time. Beetle gonna give me trouble? No, no. Beetle's not gonna give me trouble. Freaking laser missile beam turrets are going crazy though. Holy cow! This is an overpowered enemy if I ever heard one. Witnessed one, saw one, whatever you call it. Thank you for the warning. I could do with the health. This is lava, isn't it? Of course it's lava down here. Can I not 
jump up this? I can. I just didn't want to do it. That's why I'm with this. All right, dudes. Time to be the bane of my existence. There you are. Thank you. Like, why are you kicking me out? Why are you doing that? I tried to spam the bot. The bombs would not do. Are you seriously going to put me all the way through? This is so slow. Why can't I drop a bomb now? Get out of my face. Thank you. So all this place we have traversed, it's just a linear path. Not the most fun linear path, but it's a linear path. It doesn't even come with its own boss fight. I am almost dead. No, I'm not. I just lost one energy tank thing. Energy tanks, is that what they're called? Uh, yes, it's E-tanks that they're called in Mega Man. I just no, I didn't just find this. This is the normal path. Thank you, dude. I just want the gassy things out the way. You only you only have short range attacks anyway. I do not care for you or your brother friend. Time badly. Thank you. Oh, of course, the other one still is timed badly. Health, please. Thank you. Let's go to the safe station, shall we? A few days ago, that bit goal was 9.03. You are correct. Possibly. The Chozo artifacts are a pain. I have not had to deal with them yet, but I can imagine there's 12 of them. That's a lot of exploring they want us to do. A lot of discovery. Ah. Oh no. That's a long way up. Not in height, but in time. Oh. What 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 uh what scientists decide to use I mean it's nice that there are mechanical elevators I guess it'd be harder to do this in nature but even still it's so slow Thank you Done with this now No I can't skip this Trying though, in case something changes. This is their way of loading the, enough of the game. <gasps> I get you, I get you. <gasps> okay. Now we're in glitchy map land. We want to go all the way forwards? Pretty much. And we haven't accessed that elevator, so we'll just go straight forwards and go through that. Just to access it at least. That is very slow at least. Is this why or anything? Or yes. I remember. Off we go. Eventually. I cannot time that shot to be hitting the door in any of those scenarios. Nine damage, thank you very much. Youch, that was a harsh load. Okay. So it takes us back out here. This is the main area. Cool. Somehow we've made it there, but we didn't do all this. Well then, should we? No. Yes. We have touched that a bit. That's the one that takes us there. Okay. 
We want to go to the furnace. That's what it's pushing. Oh. FIFO is overflowed by gather pipe. CPU thread is too fast. Ignore and continue? You telling me that like my computer's exploding or ignore for this session? It's gone. Didn't like that. All of Dolphin's gone. There's nine energy tanks in total. Okay, cool. I thought it'd be 20. That's a bit more relieving that I've got a third of them in the game. Dolphin. Let me let me search it manually in case it accidentally like tries to upload an installer. That is also not it. Is it on the desktop? No, no, of course it's not. Okay. Okay. I'll just put in dolphin then. There it is. Herm. Hopefully it's not broken. That would be nice if it wasn't. That's the sound of a broken game, but that's just the style of the game's music right now. We count this as a death. Alrighty. Yeesh. Well, at least it's good to know we've done another 6%. And we're in Magmore, which is nice. So we're not entirely held back. I'm gonna go all, through all of Magmore again though. It's not as fun. Hey, Samus survived! Completely just. de existing. I've gotta go through the whole lava level again though. What? Furnace? Yes, it really wants me to go back to the Chozo Ruins basically. I don't know how to go there! We're on our way. Eventually. Top 10 anime awkward and saddest moments. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So, what crashed us last time? Going into the wrong area too quickly? If it happens again. I don't jump over this table. Maybe that will fix all our problems. Maybe I'll actually fight these guys. It was struggling to load through this door, wasn't it? There we go. Okay. That was a bit more comfortable for it. Right, okay, so we, go, we are to go this way. That's what I'm recognising from all this, I think. Again, it's an up and around scenario, but that's the correct direction. 
Good to know I accidentally went the wrong way and broke the game. Sort of. Like, it almost feels like I'm not making progress now, or I, I wasn't making progress up to this point. It's kind of saddening. Oh, no. Gosh, were they that long ago? I guess they were. Oh, this place. But you're not poisonous anymore. That's right. We can go through wherever we were before. Well, we go that way, or we can go to where the thing actually is, yes? Yes, so we are to go to the left. Right? Yes. Don't make the no right or left joke. No left, that's the joke. No, excuse me. Gosh, it's been like ages since I get, went through this room. How nostalgic for yesterday. Everything is not poisoned anymore, which is much nicer. So the game's a bit chuggly. This vine is very different. Actually, this is where we were at the beginning. So we're, we're doing a nice cyclical plot right now. So what, we want to go through this? Or can we just go that way? We can just go that way. No, that's where we came. Where do you want us to go, game? Through this door. The door behind us, on the bottom floor. That one. If Metroid was an anime, it'd be the end of, end of your life. Fair enough. Great, thank you, Slicey Dicey Man. Let me progress like this. Noted. I couldn't couldn't cheat the system. One impatient jump, and here I am. Stuck way back. This is not the way I wanted to go. That's the way I wanted to go. Appreciate those wooden footsteps. Thank you. And let's go. Didn't I speed through this multiple times this stream? Yes, this is the this <laughs> We're just back here again! Oh, what a cyclical plot! Stream ends and starts in the same place. us to go to the right but probably not you probably want us to actually go there's no doors here is there so let's go straight forward and go through that little extra bit So without the poison though, I must admit. Oh, this spot again? Are you kidding me? This is where they want us to go again? Because I apparently didn't explore it? Oh, maybe I just didn't go back to it. Well, we're doing it again anyway. I... Oh, this area again? Ah, thought we did it already. Oh wait, maybe it just didn't. Maybe we did. We just didn't. It didn't. We didn't go back for it again. Well, it's nice that these guys aren't a major issue. <laughs> That's how the end of that probably would have gone. Screw you guys. Yeah, it's broken again. Doing it twice anyway. Did we not have the missiles last time? 
Is that literally it? No, we didn't have anti-gravity ball, which we still do not have. Can I speed up it? Probably not. Unable to, no. Spider ball, that's what we need. Spoilers. Okay, so there is more to this place than I need to work out. Everything went pitch black in your screen. I'm glad it fixed on a refresh. And I apologize that Twitch does that. Hey, Ko and the Cow. Thank you for loving my videos. I'm glad that you do. Even amidst the changes I've been putting in. I'll be gonna be, I plan to do some uploading on Daz Let's Plays at some point, but it's gonna be different videos to normal, unfortunately. Because of the whole, I'll probably put an announcement on that as well. Because of the whole subscriber burn thing, it means if I'm playing a series and people don't watch the first three episodes, or something like that, I don't know the actual number, then the whole series is not going to get updated. And then when the series is done, people aren't going to see the next series because they're not getting advertising because of the subscriber burn. So what I'm going to do is not Let's Play series. I'll still play games. I'll do them on here and have them just as entire highlights so you can just watch at any time. If that still works, it should do, hopefully. Um, but what I'll do on Let's Plays is probably like guides and tutorials and like the sort of more generic here's how to do this kind of thing on its own little separate thing that people might be interested in like how to how to unlock every character the fastest way but everyone's already done that one so I'm not doing that one that's the way to it there's just a door there typical okay so we are going on the upper path it just doesn't want to show me the path, even though, because I just haven't gone through the door. Okay. Nope. Dude. Dude, you're a small mushroom. A blast cap at most. Why do you take so many hits? Why do you want me to spam so much? It's fun. You're right, but still, the principles say, come on, dude. And they definitely sound like Cataquacks. How did I miss, like, you all those, through all those shots, you still needed three hits, you know? And now for the final bit to punish me. Yeah, there it is. Okay, thank god they don't have knockback. Bye, Tramunas. Assuming you're going, I didn't catch it. Yes, you do. Okay, I need to go. See you later. We'll see you later. Hope you enjoyed. Did you little musical chants remind you of Discovery themes in Legend of Zelda games? I guess it's just a full Nintendo thing. Pikmin does it. I don't think Mario does it, actually. all the lasers. Excuse me. Here we are. Yes. We can do stuff here now. Because the uh, the blah 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 has gone. Which is nice. Like I guess I knew this but I figured it was like an optional thing or it wouldn't be the thing I'd be forced to do next. Undeniably. Alright. Let's go. Underwater land. For, for half an hour. Just take me to the furnace. You keep pestering about it anyway. Some good eyesight you had, considering I was under the water. Must have been loud water. Okay. Oh. That was way easy. It just lines back up somehow. Okay. Okay. Or is this where we've already been? Yes, it is. It's the other door we need. So, back through here? Oh. Okay, so it is more in the underwater stuff. Okay. Hmm. Okay, there's elevators down here. Not to be activated, but to be platformed.
This is some crazy platforming right now, guys. Ugh, wow. That was a truly magical experience. Yeah, the game's starting to chug a bit. Alright, we're good. I does it want me in ball form when I'm there? Like, what, 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 what? You know? What, 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 what? Um, are you actually an electrical pulse thing? You kind of look it. You are. Did not pick that up last time. Well, that sorts that out, and there's another one right there. Wow. Would that have fixed the acid as well from earlier? Possibly not. Elevator system. You and your timing, game. You're really making me rush for everything, aren't you? I have a question. It does freeze time. Good. It's not beside that. It's through the ball door. Which I thought was a boss area, but, you know, I could be wrong, I guess. No, no, this feels pretty... pretty pretty out of the way. Jesus, that's a horrifying rattling for time Time done soon. Good lord, no thank you. Okay. Where's the door to get to this? Or is that where I'm supposed to be going? I guess that's where I'm supposed to be going. Alright then, we'll go with that. Oh, that kind of worried, like, not worried, like, a bit scary is not the right word. Unnerving. I thought it was the way to go out. Excuse me. Since it's not, that's loads of time you've given us. For, for three platforms, that's a way lot of time. Not on a timer this time, which is nice. So what, more platforms up? Cool. Okay, that makes a bit more sense. To the furnace, shall we go? With this metallic, almost honeycomb level looking thing. Ah, finally, anti-grav, yes? We're in a mandatory area. Look up and get activate a... No, no, not look up and get a... Okay, okay. That was supposed to be like the secret area? Like... Is this just a bonus door? There's more to that place, right? If you have that, you can do that. I see. Right, okay. Oh, we're in the furnace! So yes, there's a door through there that we want. I think. Yes. But... We're in a ball room now, aren't we? We're in a ball pit. No? Is it because I went the wrong way? 
that what you're telling me? Definitely feels like I'm in a ball pit right now. There's nothing in either of these. How do I go through the other hole? Incoming scan data. So I drop a half pipe configuration. What is this? Okay, thank you. Is there multiple parts in the pipeline I can go into? No. Wait, hold on. Let me come out of this so I can see the uh, the map better while I'm out of that room. Try this trick. It works. know what you're referring to right now. Okay, so yeah, that's the pit. We want to go through the upper path, which is up top. But we need the anti-gravity, I think, for it. So we can't do it. It's told me to come here and it's like, you can't do it. That was all for an E-tank. Yeah? Come on, gang, you can load. <sighs> this game, man. Is it trying to be a pain? So then it won't let me progress because I don't have anti grab here. I can't go to the other place because I don't have double jump to do the platforming, presumably. Can I do? It wants me to go back to the overworld. Over like now, I'm more getting just stuck in everywhere at once. So I think we're not gonna be able to find a boss in 20 minutes. It's gonna be the anticlimax because that's how this game has designed itself. I think we're gonna win it off here. I'm afraid. Just cause I try to make an ending, and the game was like, no, screw that. Just keep walking in circles for a bit. We'll eventually get all nine. Feels like more, like 15 E tanks, probably. It's just going to keep telling me to keep going all these directions, but. What can you do? There is stuff I missed, so we'll be going back to find it eventually, I guess. We might play this next week, like Monday, Tuesday. Probably. Um, I'm also going to see if there's anything else on the Elgato. Uh, Dolphin that I want to play. I was going to see if I can fix my Elgato. I haven't actually checked that does work. Now I've reset my PC. But uh, otherwise, yes, I am going to be ending it off. Seven deaths in total for this session? Fair enough. Well, thank you for joining me. And apparently I continue playing music. Well, that's fun in the background. Oh well. Play some of that lovely music. Go over to this. And can I mute the game? I can. Magic. I, I crossed it off. Thank you for joining me this far. Let's go into more interesting music if we can. No? Not, not going to do that? There you go. That's something. That's just the same track again. Shall we do that? There you go. It's another YouTube advert. Well, I hope you enjoyed anyway. My name's been Daz. You don't really care. It's more... It's, this is where we just were. We don't want the Chozo ruins. There we go. My name's been Daz, you didn't really care, and I'll see you in a bit. I should mute myself instead of just dancing semi-silently. Bye-bye.